Hello everybody, and today I'm going to be giving you an update on everything happening with Flamingo slash Albert, because at this point, people are doxing him and leaking old photos of him, sending him die threats, bringing up old allegations that just plainly aren't true, and just a whole lot of other stuff that's going on with this drama. But before I start, I want to go ahead and say that in all of these situations, I feel like Albert's intentions were never negative, and overall, he's had a positive impact on this community rather than a negative one, so even if you are offended by some of his jokes, or what he's done inside of the past, I would still consider how much of a positive impact he's had on the community before trying to cancel him and all this other stuff that people are trying to do, including leaking his number and address, which is horrible, and if you see any of this stuff online, make sure you block it and report it, because either way, this is not right, and at this point, I really just hope Albert is okay. But before I start, make sure you guys go ahead and like the video and subscribe with notifications on so more people know about the situation and know to report and block all of these accounts that are trying to share Albert's information online. Anyways, to begin with some background information, obviously if you haven't watched my previous video on it, I will go and watch it after this for more context. A summary of what happened is Albert actually posted a tweet saying finally things are back to normal and the trending topics were very suspicious, definitely controversial, but under that somebody replied with the ends. Then he replied with a joke posting a picture of Adolf, I'm standing still, AI cover, Elton John, which you can probably see how this is obviously a joke. He didn't mean to offend anyone with this. Either way though, I feel like it's not a thing that he should be doing just because of how massive his platform is. With this much of a prolific guy that did all these horrible things, I feel like it's obvious that people are not going to like it. So I feel like Flamingo should have just never made this joke in the first place. But either way, it was definitely an offensive tweet. And this is just one of the many tweets that were criticizing him for saying it. And as you can see, this guy named Billy the Coolest said, as a Jewish person i can't really find it in my heart to forgive you especially with everything going on right now but at least you apologized and this was after flamingo made his apology saying yeah dumb tweet didn't realize how that one came off in my head was responding to a thing about ends with an insane video that popped up sorry and then he apologized again saying i understand truly didn't mean any hurt i'm sorry for saying this in such an ignorant and unneeded way so he ended up apologizing but a ton of people did not like his apology at all and he even lost 10 year plus fans over it. So this is someone's manifesto that they wrote basically describing how their experience with this caused them to not be Flamingo's fan anymore after 10 plus years. 10 years down the drain over an end joke. I don't know what to do now. My whole personality is based around him and now I have to change that. My whole personality because of a joke. I love him to death. He's the sole reason why I'm mentally stable right now and seeing him go down like this because of a stupid thing he said is ridiculous. I can't defend him I'm not going to he needs to know what he said was bad and what he did was bad and he needs to be able to hold himself accountable for that he needs to go over what he said and make an apology and not some bad one one that actually means something a bad one is not going to save his career or his fandom I'm just hoping he fix it because I can't really lose the man I've spent almost 10 years watching this guy so as you see from that this guy was obviously very heartfelt when making this tweet and he's a longtime supporter of Flamingo so he has no reason to lie his whole account was just based around Flamingo and yet this changed everything. Comment down below, do you think people are overreacting at this or do you think people like this guy are right and that Flamingo should make a full-blown apology video or an apology tweet or something more than just two random tweets in the replies? But no doubt whether you think that this is offensive or that they're overreacting, personally I'm leaning way more towards this tide of overreacting because at the end of the day you can tell that his intentions were not that bad. His intentions were to just make a funny joke. He posted a random video that he found online that was eye-catching. Now, should he have done this on this public Twitter account with thousands and thousands of followers, especially during this time period of war? Obviously not. But should he really have his whole entire career ruined over this one tweet? Because that would be pretty insane. However, at this point, I do think that Flamingo does need to address it just because of how massive the situation is. Like, it's trending with over 45k posts, so a ton of people are talking about this, and so far, he's only replied twice and they've both been inside of a tweet longer so not very many people have actually seen the reply and more people have noticed that he made this joke rather than him actually having apologized for it twice. But moving on to the fact that he was doxxed on Twitter because of this. And the craziest thing is this account that doxxed him is still up to this day. If you see it make sure you report it. It's actually disgusting that this hasn't been deleted yet. I've personally reported it. I've been trying to get as many people to report it as possible 
possible because it's literally private information that should not be shared at all. He didn't do enough to get doxxed. Like you can see this photo that was shown on there. Obviously, I'm gonna blur it, but this is unblurred on this Twitter account randomly. I don't even know where they got this leak from, but this isn't even the worst of it because they've been quote tweeting all his replies with his address, phone number, and his full name. Now, whether this information is actually true or not, which I'm sure it is since he's done house tours and stuff, does not matter because this account needs to get taken down. Like, Albert does not deserve to get docked for this at all. With this being brought up though, people have also brought up other situations where he's apparently supported groomers inside of the Roblox myth community. As you can see, this person tweeted saying, Albert bought and has worn the Saint Tribe banner, a group known for having predators slash weirdos in its past and present. The current leader has defended a literal P and tried so hard to keep Omni in his group. Albert was well aware of Saint Tribe past and present, including what Omni did, and has read the doc about it, but continues to support the group. Then he continues saying, when you are a YouTuber of this popularity, and you are actively staying in groups and supporting them, or even staying friends with people you know are dangerous, that is a problem. You are a part of the problem. Referring to Flamingo. So, this person is obviously really mad about this. I'm not sure if Albert actually had a prior history of knowing this. However, I do know Omni is definitely a confirmed P, otherwise known as a dangerous person in the community, and Albert definitely definitely should not be supporting them, and you've probably noticed if you do watch Flamingo, he's actually been straying away from the myth community just because of how many dangerous people are in it that are going after minors, so from this he's probably gonna stay even further away from that community, and I definitely don't blame him, a lot of people in that community are disgusting to say the least. Other stuff being brought up has even caused Albert's longtime editor, Polar Cub, to give a personal response on what happened. Albert is a good person, being friends with him and working with him has left a huge positive impact on my life. In my time and experience knowing him, I genuinely do not believe he would intentionally do anything to hurt a group of people. That being said, the tweet was stupid and did not need to exist. I'm pretty sure he's aware of this and that's all I can comment on and I don't speak for him. Now, I feel like this was a good response from her because obviously she doesn't speak for him, but you can see that Flamingo almost has always positive intentions and this tweet definitely did not need to be made in the first place. Like, I can tell that he's trying to be more edgy because people do want him to turn back into more of his Albert stuff type of content, where back in the day he used to make way more horrific jokes or controversial jokes in general, which definitely has been heavily criticized by the community. But from this, you could probably tell that he's going to end up stopping doing this just because of the massive impact that this has had over just a single tweet, which he didn't even actually say any words. All he did was post a YouTube link. Provided I do see why people are offended by it, but at the same time, people who want him to return to Albert stuff but are also also saying that he can't make these types of jokes are probably messing with his head. I'm sure that Albert is extremely confused right now. Like, I'm sure it's really hard to be inside of a community where they want you to make horrific jokes, but at the same time, the border is so thin. You can post a YouTube link, and if it's the wrong one, you'll get massively canceled. Anyways, make sure you guys go ahead and like the video and subscribe with notifications on for more videos talking about different situations going on in the community, as I post pretty much every single day. Just like this situation, I talk about every situation. Also, comment down below your opinion. Were you offended by what he said or do you think that he should continue making jokes like this and goodbye.